What is up guys and girls? So in this video I'm going to show you the locations of the Q-Beam, three locations of the Q-Beam, now early game, later game and kind of middle game. The first one is going to be in the hardware labs in the Beams and Waves laboratory and I'm doing this because I got through most of the game and then went to my inventory at one point and the Q-Beam wasn't there so I either recycled it accidentally or um, I dropped it when you try and sort your inventory with no space it sometimes drops an item. So I thought I'd make a guide on these three locations. So here we have the first one, Hardware Labs, like I said, So I like to call the Beamer. Next one is Shipping and Receiving in the Cargo Bay. Now this is just before you can go for the Gates of Hell trophy, which I've got a guide for as well. But this is a strange location for a Q-Beam or a weapon, really, because um, I'm not sure if these are going to spawn in the same place every time or if this thing is kind of a random spawn I still don't know this but it can't harm to have a look anyways so we're in the cargo bay there or shuttle bay no it is the cargo bay you'll need leverage 3 to get through this little gap and inside the supply crate which I normally find food so I was surprised to find a beamer in there Next up is going to be a bit more difficult. This is the Shuttle Bay airlock. Now if you look at the bottom of that airlock, there is a Trans Star Corp. You have that facing downwards. Then look up and you'll see the fiery mist. Not fire, just the golden mist. And head towards that. Then once you get here, head towards those white cylinders. It's so easy to get turned around here because there is obviously no map support. Okay, once you're there, look to your left and you'll see another hole there. And that is where we want to go. So that's where the airlock is there. And I think I'll do one more point of reference. Okay, these white cylinders, sure. And then just to the left of it, you will see a lobby written on the wall there another point of reference because I did get lost trying to get back to the airlock a couple of times but anyway we're gonna head into this little breached area and within we'll find ourselves a transcribe as well as a another beamer I really think that if you've upgraded a weapon and you accidentally try and put it into the recycling bin it should say hold on you sure you want to recycle this you've spent a lot of time upgrading it something like that well, there we go. All right, guys, I hope you find this video informative and I hope you're able to keep this weapon for the entire game. So I'm going to leave you with some end screens as usual. And always, guys, please remember, like if you like, subscribe if you really liked. And I'll see you next time.